Welcome back to our layout. One of my favorite jobs is to run period correct Amtrak Rainbow Era trains. The variety of motive power and passenger cars is unreal. Here in North Coast Hiawatha, and through the Pacific Northwest. There we catch a uh, 1970 Burlington Northern passenger train and we're out from Portland to Seattle. Ian has a rare for 1970. Congratulations. Congratulations. And we catch up with the North Coast High. A variety of Burlington Northern and predecessor equipment. One of my favorite trains of the 70s, Southern Railways Piedmont. Two FP7s. Couple of cars. The Piedmont never went through Oregon City, but the engines did. In 1976, they did Southern Railway discontinued the train after the day after Thanksgiving. They were, the engines were still in good shape, Amtrak leased a few, and they were spotted on many of the trains in and out of Seattle down to Portland. That lasted about a year or so until all the uh, F-40s came out. My favorite train that I grew up watching was Southern Railway No. 1 and 2, the Southern Crescent. So these aren't perfect, but they're pretty close. I made the Bicentennial 1976 decals on them, on the E8s. Today, two passenger FP7s are subbing for one of the ailing E8s. Go down the line. There's the Amtrak through cars from Los Angeles, making it truly a New York to Los Angeles train and then we're following up with two southern business cars on the far end gone but not forgotten is Amtrak's Pioneer running from Salt Lake City to Portland started out with just uh, Amfleet cars then grew to some sleepers a baggage it's a nice little Amtrak train. They never ran through Oregon City, but this is what it would have looked like. And then arrived in Portland, tiptoeing through the yards.